Hey YouTube, um, I'm just making this quick video to show you a couple of cool things you can do with your Samsung Galaxy S2. Uh, these include connecting your USB flash disks using a USB OTG adapter, um, connecting your Samsung Galaxy S2 uh, via an MHL adapter to your HDTV for uh, some 1080p uh, video output and mirroring and also uh, connecting USB mice, uh, USB, uh, Bluetooth mice and Bluetooth keyboards. Um, let's quickly show you uh, the features of the USB OTG. Today I'm only going to show you um, what happens when you connect a USB flash disk but it's possible to also connect um, like USB mice through this and they work fine. So when you plug this in it should flash up in the top any moment now. USB host cable connected. And then once you plug in uh, the flash disk, it will flash up again. USB device connected and it will do a med quick media scan. Now I've only put a couple of videos just to give you a quick demo. So if we go and check the folder contents, my files, and I scroll down quickly to the bottom, and USB storage. Whoa. Yeah, a couple of Thundercats videos. If I just play the first one, so this is uh, streaming straight from uh, the USB flash disk, and you can uh, forward through this. It plays perfectly fine, but. So that's a uh, USB OTG on the go. Let's quickly disconnect this and I'll show you um, Bluetooth in action. Um, so there's a bit of confusion over whether you can connect more than one Bluetooth device um, at the same time uh, on the Samsung Galaxy S2 and this will dispel um, any disagreements or anything to do with whether you can do that or not so if I just quickly show you that in Bluetooth so yeah apparently I've already paired it you can see they're both paired at the same time um, but if we could just connect them both See, that's the mouse. If I just bring the keyboard into play here, um, you can see I'm controlling the mouse on the screen. And if I press Escape, that acts as the back button on the on the Samsung. See? And uh, I can use the arrow keys to select where I want to go on the screen or use the mouse to do that as well or, and then you can click and drag to go between screens also it's pretty cool especially when you got this working in conjunction with the MHL uh, adapter to your s big screen which I'll show you in a quick moment Hey YouTube, uh, just wanted to quickly show you um, the Samsung Galaxy S2 connected via an MHL cable to my HDTV. As you can see, um, one end is a micro USB, the other end is a HDMI, but um, in order to function it still requires an extra uh, micro USB cable uh, to power up the device and I have connected this to my Xbox currently. Um, but um, I've also still maintained uh, Bluetooth with my mouse and keyboard so yep that means you can still do your big screen browsing on your TV just fine uh, so let me quick give you a quick demo uh, I'll give you uh, the browser a quick trailer in 1080p and um, a game let's see how it looks like okay guys hold on while I stabilize this camera A 
Okay. So. Yeah, the first thing you notice, the pointer is still there because I've got my mouse connected and a wireless keyboard. The wireless keyboard being used is an, an Apple uh, Bluetooth wireless and this is a £7 uh, optical mouse from the 7 day shop. Both work absolutely fine together. Uh, so, quick demo of the browser. Um, works fine. Bear in mind that this is uh, the phone scaled up to 1080 so it's still at a resolution of 800 by 400 um, let's uh, bring up a website so you can see um, gadget.com yep and um, unfortunately the scroll wheel uh, doesn't scroll down the website so you still have to click and drag um, but it's still smooth, very very smooth and works brilliantly you can double click uh, to zoom in and then uh, there's a bit of text reflow if you enable it in the options and then double click to zoom back out um, I'll give you a quick demo of YouTube uh, straight from the browser not from the application it's loaded the mobile site but as you'll be able to see right here um, it does uh, load up the video in its internal player hey ASOS, Michael here and I am in Regent's Park in London joined by Tom from Slash when it does this uh, it no longer scales in 800 by 400 but gives you the full 1080 if it's available Okay, uh, now I'll show you a quick trailer. Uh, if I just go to my files, uh, scale across. Uh, trailers. Let's try Born Automaton. So this is running at full 1080p, but uh, it's only at 30 hertz. But it still looks fantastic. very crisp and very smooth Okay, lastly, um, I'll show you a quick game. Um, whoops, let's see. Which one? Let's do Angry Birds. Uh, I haven't tried Angry Birds Rio on the screen. Oh, it looks quite nice. Um. So, games work fine full screen. Let's see with the mouse. Yep. Uh, yeah. Oh, I suck. Um, one more try, and then... Whoops. Okay. Game over. <laughs> uh, let's exit this. Uh, my mouse doesn't work great on the carpet. Anyway, um, I hope that's given you some food for thought with um, the various 
things you can do uh, with the Samsung Galaxy S2 and uh, in my opinion it can only get better. Enjoy guys.